This is the community of Moyers Corners, just six miles north of Liverpool. I guess you might call it typical of many small towns in America. Moyers Corners is also the home of Bill and Ruth Dudley, a very remarkable couple. Bill's a tinsmith in the radio and television department at Electronics Park. Bill and Ruth have 12 children, ranging in age from four and a half to 28, and four grandchildren. Five years ago, Moyers Corners had no fire protection of its own, and the Dudleys and some of their neighbors were concerned about the security of their homes and their families. That concern resulted in an intensive drive for funds to man and operate a volunteer fire company. This equipment was quickly purchased, and the building to house it was built by the men themselves. The women formed a ladies' auxiliary and soon furnished this kitchen and dining room on the first floor of the fire hall. The second floor was made into a dance hall. While Ruth Dudley was serving as president of the ladies' auxiliary, a violent highway accident occurred in the area, and she suggested that ambulance service be added to the fire protection. This completely equipped ambulance was the result of a fundraising drive. It has answered almost 100 calls in the past two years. There were other GE employees among the 40 volunteers of the Moyers Corners Fire Department, and they all took first aid courses together. Tom Hunter is general foreman of maintenance in the same section as Bill Dudley. Gail Allen of the manufacturing section in the radio and television department is a volunteer. Yes, Bill Dudley and his neighbors provided for the security of their own homes and families against fire and other disasters by banding together for protection. But there are other forms of mishap from which the Dudley family is secure. Bill, like other GE employees, belongs to the GE Mutual Benefit Association. In case of sickness or accident, most of his doctor and hospital bills will be taken care of. His large family will receive money to help tide them over until Bill is on his feet again. And when it comes time for Bill to hang up his tools at General Electric and retire, there will be a GE pension to help take care of him and his wife in their later years. Secure on the home front, secure on the economic front, Bill Dudley is indeed a happy man.